So I want to make a crescendo snare roll that starts quiet and gets louder. Uh, I have a snare here. It's all one velocity. And it sounds really dumb. So we're going to take this and we're going to make it start quiet and get louder as it progressively goes. Instead of sitting here and changing the velocity of every hit like this, that would be really tedious and annoying for how long this type of roll is. Uh, I'm going to highlight it, all my little drums that I want to change. And I'm going to go up here to where it says function. And then MIDI transform and crescendo. What I want to do now on this crescendo page is I need to change these two uh, numbers because this is going to be where you want the crescendo to start. And then the one on the bottom is where it stops uh, crescendoing. So to figure out these numbers, I need to uh, see where the snare roll starts. I'm going to do that by putting my cursor right here at the beginning. Then it shows me the number right here. If yours looks different, it doesn't look like this. It probably, if it doesn't look like that, it probably looks like this or something. Um, just click on this little arrow, go down to custom, and it's going to show you all the cool stuff. So it starts on 211, and then it's going to end on 411. So put it back, or let me go back to uh, functions. Why did I close out? I'm going to change this to 211 and then 411, I think. Then the next thing I need to do is change uh, this number here because this is going to be where what velocity I want the uh, snare roll to start. And then the one below it is where it's going to end. I want it to end on 127, so I'm going to leave that. This first one, I'm going to just bring it down to like 50 because I don't really know where to bring it right now. And then I'm going to hit operate only, and now I should have a crescendoed snare drum. Thank you for watching.